The Tech Nerdist channel is brought to you by these fine Patreon supporters. If you'd like to check us out on Patreon, pop over to www.patreon.com slash technivorous. That's T-E-C-H-N-I-V-O-R-O-U-S. Here, we do our best to stay up to date on the latest and greatest in 3D printing and tech and keep you informed on the latest developments in these sectors. So, if you're interested in getting updates on 3D printing or technology such as programming, robotics, artificial intelligence, and things of that nature, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, leave a like on this video, and comment about what you'd like to see in the future because we make these videos for you. Hey folks, Technivers here. I have an awesome new website that I would like to show you guys. So we're gonna jump over to my other camera here. Let's get a little bit better view. This is circuito.io. So it's basically exactly as it sounds, circuit o.io and this is an amazing app so basically let me go ahead and get rid of everything here so I can kind of show you what this does so if I select it I can remove items we're gonna go ahead and leave the board there and I can actually show you kind of what this does so um, let's say I want to see how to wire in an LED um, RGB so we'll take this one so if I click on that and hit add it is going to bring it in. It's going to bring in a breadboard and it's going to show me how to wire it. Okay. And then these ports that I'm using, uh, two on this side and the five volt and ground on this side. If I highlight it again, you can see there is a test code section. Let's see here. Uh, the X here denotes that there is no test code for this. Um, if you need the code, I have quite a few of them. Let's see if we can find one. Um, here we go. This is a monochrome 1.3 inch OLED graphic display. And this one does actually have test code for it. So um, you can hit add there. Um, and you can continue to add components to your circuit. You can also change the board to a Raspberry Pi or several other options. Um, this is pretty interesting. So view info. Okay, so it says we'll be redirected to the component editor, which means that this component has code in it already. Um, log in with GitHub and launch workspace. We'll try that out. So, authorize gitpod.io. Agree. And it is loading up here. I don't need to install this extension. I can, but you don't have to. Um, so we basically have everything here. Um, and then we're looking at a nice IDE where everything's pretty much pretty well integrated. So um, in order to create a local development environment, so there's some steps to go through here, and that's that's not really what this video is about. We can we can go through the code. I can show you the code on my uh, different sections as well, but I thought this was really nice for just adding parts and getting your wiring diagram it works really really well. So let's try the seven segment. Add that. Uh, and this is one I've wired up before. I do have code for this on one of my uh, Arduino videos. And it works really well, actually. I actually, there's one for a scrolling text to implement across here as well. So one of the really, really cool things about this is that it allows you to kind of just throw together different components and see how best to wire them. So I'm gonna add a red light and let's add a colored LED as well. And it kind of shows you the minimum of what you need and where you need to wire everything and everything like that. So really, really handy for working on Arduino projects. And like I said, not just Arduino. If we go into controllers here, get rid of that, go into controllers, and you can see that there are multiple boards. And in fact, we can find a Raspberry Pi. Uh, and we can switch to that board. Just hit the swap button. And it shows us how to wire to our Raspberry Pi. So really, really cool. 
very very simple piece uh it also tells you up here if you look this is a parts list so basically um it's telling you everything that you have in this circuit and how much it'll cost and it says the prices are estimates but you can basically get a good idea of what you're paying for here and then you can also buy them by clicking the buy link so um pretty cool pretty nifty definitely give it a look if you found this video useful or you think you're going to be trying out Cir circuito.io please leave a comment down below and let everybody else know how you feel about it that is going to be it for this video guys well that's it guys that's going to wrap up this video if you've noticed the shirt the merch is available go ahead and check out the teespring merch link down below it won't be available on a channel store until i reach 10,000 subscribers and so far i am just about to hit 5,000 so uh, it'll be a little while a couple more months before you see this on the actual channel But they are available now. I have a couple other designs Feel free to pop over there and check them out and know that any purchase through the Teespring site Definitely helps to promote our site here and increase the channel's ability to make videos in the future So we appreciate all your support Don't forget to check out the Teespring link check out our patreon link Leave a like on this video and hit that subscribe button because we have a lot more coming at you in the coming days.